Hey, Council, how you doing? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and other placements. All right, this is a love message for those on the zodiac side of Cancer. All right, don't forget, Cancer, to hit that like button, okay? All right, Cancer, this is uh, what awaits you in love. What awaits Cancer's in love? Cancer, they say romance. You got one card. You got the Cupid card. Out of all the cards in the deck, you got one card. So, Council, look like you're going to be on, on the field of romance, in a, on, in a romantic place. All right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, look like you're going to be opening up to somebody, especially when it comes to a, a relationship. Because you want this person to know that uh, you're going to open up. All right? So this is a message for the singles counselors. Since they didn't give me one card, I'm gonna make sure I do a single and and uh and the other one. All right. We just did Taurus, okay. All right. So clarify the romance card for those under the zodiac sign of counselor, please. All right, counsel, look like you got some kind of contest going on. It don't have to be. You could be a celebrity here, all right, and you're planning on taking one particular person out or one person out, all right, to win some kind of contest. Now, okay, that's what they're saying now. All right, I see you, counsel, going towards this person and giving them a rose. Counsel, they say your first impression is your best impression, okay, so make sure when you see this person, when you reach out to this person, be on your best behavior, okay, on day one. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a lot of gossip and stuff around you, uh, taking this person out. Uh, not only that, this is the first date, so they're telling you to be on your best behavior, okay? Poi is my brother, my sister. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these drama motherfuckers over here, yeah, they're gossipers. They're gossipers, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are people that you know. These are people you know. Look like you're going to take somebody on a trip, maybe on a flight. Mm -hmm, a trip on a plane or something. All right, you look like you got an executive producer or somebody here that's going to be setting everything up. It's not going to be just you and that person one-on-one -on -one because you're doing that for uh, to make sure that there ain't no, um, uh, no accusations or nothing like that so you can be sued. I heard you. So you're taking them on a group date. I heard that. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. You thinking this out thoroughly? How exactly how you gonna do it? You got an advisor. Somebody's gonna help you. There's a host here as well, and, and you might just be the host, and everybody get to go out with you. So it's more than just one person, but you got one main person. Okay. All right, and that's gonna be the person that you're really interested in. All right. Yeah, that's the one you see as a beauty queen. Okay. Yeah, that's the one that you're gonna take dancing. Mm hmm Yeah, that's the one that you're gonna open up to. Mm hmm yeah, that's the one that you think about putting the ring on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then come the celebration. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're going to take good care of this person, counselor. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Mm -hmm. And guess what? You beat out all the competition if there was any. Shoot, you own that shit, counselor. Mm -hmm. Butterflies, butterflies. A lot of transformation in your relationship. All right? Mm -hmm. Even in old girl or old boy's relationship. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, you're going to change this person for the best or for the better. All right? Things going to get better for them. Mm -hmm. All right? Yes, indeed. Yes, it is. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. They might have been used to wearing cut off jeans, okay? There's no name brand. You're going to have them wearing name brand cut off jeans. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, you're going to find ways to market this motherfucker's ideas and the things they're doing. They think they're there just for nothing? Oh, no. You got a whole plan for it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take, I'm going to take, I'm going to take Mr. or Mrs. Nothing and make them into something. Uh-huh. And when they walk out to the relationship, if they decide to walk out, they're going to be a paid motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're going to be a paid maid. 